Mid Journey version 6.1 is finally here, you guys, and Mid Journey claims that it has some of the most major updates that we were missing in the previous version, like coherent images, better image quality, better typography, and faster model. So, in this video, we're gonna go ahead and test exactly that and see whether Mid Journey claims are true or whether we are still missing out on some certain things. All right, so starting off, here are some of the few claims that Mid Journey appears to do, like in the new version of Mid Journey V. 6.1 you'll get more Koran images meaning you'll get better arms better legs you don't know no certain deformation like we used to see in the previous version you'll get much better image quality you'll get more precise detail and Koran small image features like you know in certain images where there are like more people you used to get deformation in the eyes like distortion you won't see that now that is mid journey claiming for now but we're gonna test it out and now you're gonna get new 2x upscalers with much better image quality and roughly 25 person faster for standard image jobs right so that's exactly we're gonna go ahead and test out by comparing version 6.1 with the previous version of mid journey that was v6 all right so without further ado let's just start the comparison all right so starting off here are two images that i created on the left we have from mid journey v6 and on the right we have from mid journey v6.1 the new version uh, so this was from like a bustling New York C Street at sunset, yellow taxis and crowds of people, vibrant billboards and tall skyscrapers, right? So in version V6, you guys can see, right? Uh, image quality looks kind of a comic, right? It doesn't appear to be very realistic. And I didn't type in my prompt like it's some kind of a comic or something, but it generated by its own. So definitely the taxis, uh, they're looking like some kind of a drawing or comic and it doesn't appear to be like as good as sunset right so that was my focus but if you go ahead and see in version 6.1 so yeah the taxes look a lot realistic now and you guys can see i'm getting that subtle lighting of sunset that i wanted in my and the image appears to be really good so this is kind of a major difference that you get now uh with the new version of mid journey v6.1 and yeah another thing uh the new version image appears to be more pleasing to the eyes as well right all right, so similarly, if you start uh, with some human portraits, so I basically type in my prompt that a young French woman in a barrel with curly red hair, playful and charming face. So on the left side, we have the image of a Virgin 6 mid journey. And you guys can see the image looks all right. I'm not complaining that much. Obviously, the previous version was as good as the new one. The image looks good. We have all the fantastic realistic details that I want in the props. But if you take a look at the right side, like the Virgin 6.1 image, so absolutely only the image quality looks way much better now we have so much details on the face on the eyebrows and everything and the image appears to be more pleasing to eye right you guys can see we can either see like the feathers on uh the girl's sweater as well right it's literally we can see right over here we can see the dust on her hat and yeah we get more and more detail in the image and yet we get a lot of detail in the image and the image quality looks absolutely fantastic on the mid journey v6.1 right and similarly the same goes with this human portrait as well so this was a portrait photograph of an older chinese woman in traditional attire with long white you guys can see the left side is virgin 6 image and yeah it looks good i'm not going to complain on that but take a look at on the right one right uh we get a lot Lot of detail into that and looks very very realistic very amazing and the bouquet effect especially in the version 6.1 looks absolutely perfect right so we can truly say like the claim of mid journey like you get absolutely beautiful image quality now with mid journey v6.1 is really really useful you guys and additionally, I basically went ahead and test out some of the abstract art in both of the versions of Mid Journey. This was my prompt, like a man's portrait fragmented into matrix shapes, capturing multiple perspectives at once, features rearranged challenge, right? And you guys can see on the left side in Mid Journey V6, basically kind of uh, messed up my image and the face looks totally blown out, right? But on the right hand, if you guys can see, the face looks a lot symmetrical. Uh, we get the geometric shapes in that as well. And it looks very, very good to my eye. But yeah, of the Mid Journey V6, I'm not sure about that. It's like passable. It's not that bad. But obviously, like uh, the Mid Journey V6.1 looks much, much better, right? But don't get me wrong, guys. It's not the best every time. Like, take a look at this image. So this this was basically an even photography of a lively dance floor at a wedding reception and you guys can see there are a lot of human beings 
uh, in the image of Mid Journey V6, and somehow it basically managed to get everyone in the frame, and we don't see any severe deformation. Just messed up an eye of this one, but other than that, the image looks great, right? Surprisingly, there is no deformation in the version V6, but if you take a look at the same prompt in the version 6.1, the lighting looks really great. It looks absolutely fantastic, but the image appears to be a bit blown out to me, right? And yet the eye, it looks kind of bad. All right, so now let's talk about typography in the new version of mid journey v6.1 so yeah typography has gone way way better right so now we don't have to see like really bad typos that we used to see in the previous version of mid journey so now take a look at this example right so this was my prompt uh, a vibrant graffiti mural on a city wall with the words urban post so you guys can see on the version 6 clearly it messed up my phone and yet yeah, uh the phone didn't look that good but if you take a look at the version 6.1 so yeah we don't see any error in our typography and yeah the typography has gone very very better right and similarly for our next example like take a look at this one so yeah you guys can see uh, we have an error a typo in our typography over here and similarly take a look at this one right everything looks hop noid the phone looks really really amazing this is how you can go ahead and create amazing typographies now with the new version of mid journey right okay so now let's talk about anime characters like how anime characters have also gone better uh in mid journey v6 was this was our image from the mid journey v6 yeah it looks great but the features they are lacking a little bit right uh so yeah the image looks great in it but if we take a look at the virgin v6.1 so clearly the quality has boosted a lot right so everything is so pleasing to eye and the skin tone is really really good in this anime so this was basically just a normal prom like an anime school girl yeah it basically created amazing results for us you guys can see the version 6.1 image looks really really good right you guys and also you guys uh, the logo creation have also been really good in the mid journey v6.1 so this was like a hot coffee colorful logo multicolor palette yeah you guys can take an idea like clearly the version 6.1 nailed the logo creation right all right so now let's talk about a very amazing cool feature uh, that we get new in the mid journey v6.1 so now with the quality parameter you get amazing results with the mid journey v6.1 right so these both are images from the mid journey v6.1 so i basically type when i prompt a middle-aged american man in a leather jacket with short brown hair and on the left side the image was without the quality prompt and on the right side the quality i basically went ahead and did that to two right and clearly you guys can see there is a major difference right so this image looks great uh looks very decent nice quality nice detailing but take a look at this one right like the detail has gone crazy we can see like the fine particles in his sweater uh we can see the graininess on the face like the quality has gone absolutely mad you guys right and similarly uh for this example so i type in my prom a young british woman in a jacket with baby blonde hair so the on the left side there is no quality parameter and on the right side I basically went ahead and jumped that to two and take a look at the difference right this image looks great the details are really nice but yeah for this image the lighting uh the skin tone the detailing like take a look at the hair everything the quality is surely boosted now and the quality parameter reverts really really well now with mid journey v6.1 okay so there you have it guys this was the exploration of the new update of mid journey that is mid journey v6.1 surely uh, the claims of mid journey are almost perfect we get nice typography we get nice portraits nice realistic images and everything looks very pleasing to the eyes except for two or three use cases but yeah the results are quite noticeable and now you can create uh like much better results that you used to do with the mid journey v6 right so i hope you like this video guys and i'll see you in the next one until then take care Bye-bye.